for enough power. Hi, how's it going everyone? So today we are revisiting an old deck. This week is all about trying old decks in new metas and see how it performs and one of this deck is Exodia Patriot. It's one of the most fun Exodia deck, easily attainable, not that difficult and in this case you can push for high amounts of power as well and there's a lot of different strategies if you don't draw your Exodia Patriot combo. And there's one inclusion here, a new inclusion, which is Crystal. Because Crystal, you know, allows us to draw a card this time round. I mean, last time it's pretty shitty, but with this one, it helps us to reach our Exodia combo a lot um, easier in this case. And the whole key thing you want to do here, right, is pretty straightforward. The key thing you want to do here is you need to grab your magic, extend the turn to turn 7, otherwise your combo can't run at all. And once you have extended the turn, on turn 6, you drop your Onslaught and then you drop your Mystic to copy Onslaught's doubling power so you are doubling twice and then you drop Patriot after that. So your one lane has to have Onslaught, Mystic, Patriot. So this allows you to boost your no ability cards, pushing them to about 13 power per card, 13 to 15 power per card. And in this case, our no ability cards are Wasp, Squirrel Go, Mr. Sinister, Shocker, and Brute. So in the early rounds, in the first three turns, you are trying to establish the board with all these no ability cards. Minimally, the best would be to have two no ability cards. Even one no ability card is also pretty good, pretty decent because you are pushing for 13 power. But the best case scenario, if you are very, very lucky with your draws, try and push two no ability cards in each lane. And then in that one empty lane, you dedicate it to your Patriot Exodia Onslaught combo. So that's how you play that combo. Of course, if you can't grab your magic, if you can't grab your Patriot on Onslaught in time, you can always just do a typical generic kind of Patriot combo. You can do a Patriot Mystic turn 6, or you can do a Patriot Onslaught turn 5 and turn 6 scenario here. So using Onslaught to double Patriot's ability. Or you can even do a long play where you do Patriot on turn 3, turn 4, Mystic, then turn 6 you drop Onslaught. That works too. So there's a lot of different outs in this case where if you can't draw your Exodia combo, you can still push for high amounts of power. And overall, I think having Crystal in the deck definitely increases the odds of us drawing our Patriot Exodia combo, which is nice. I mean, you see quite a couple of games where I can push for 30 power for 2 lanes, which is pretty sick, man. And I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay. If you have been enjoying it, consider checking out the Patreon, supporting the channel. It really helps out a lot in terms of keeping this channel alive. Yeah. Okay, we at least have one onslaught. And we have crystal too, so that's not too bad. Think what we will do is we will do a shocker on the middle. Two times District X and Weird World consecutively, like. Seriously. Two two games in a row. This kind of ridiculous location. I'm not complaining. Spices up my life. Looks like games. Oh. There's like way too much happening here. There's literally way too much happening. We are and the peak. Feels like it's running some sort of Exodia combo. So we will take a look at it and see how it goes. I am Iron Man. Okay, I know what he's doing. He's running there. He's running. He's running negative. Wait, am I drawing for his deck? Nani? Why does he have Patriot too? Is that my Patriot or his Patriot? Oh, no, 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 no. He changed the location really. We are drawing back our cards. So that's fine. Um. Yep, I think this is cool. And he can't, re he, he, he can't copy Iron Man anymore, right? So I think we are, we are pretty good here. So next turn we draw... Ah, shit. Wait. We only have one chance to draw the cards that we need. We really need our... Yeah. Because we will draw our America Chavez now. This is a tough one. Please give me... Please give me my mystic. 
Please give me my mystic. Please give me my mystic. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. This is the full Exodia combo, man. This is a one out of two, fifty percent chance. Might be a bit late. He might run away, but I think he has committed, so he can't really lose here. Oh my god! Why did he do that? Ooh. I don't think it's enough, man. The fact that he couldn't copy the Iron Man, right? He didn't copy. He lost. He needs the Iron Man to to win. Nice. Full Exodia combo. <laughs> awesome. We are the better Exodia, I guess, in this case. Yeah. I think the only way for them to win really is to flip their deck around and he couldn't flip it in time and look at this like only one of them it was flipped and he didn't even draw any of them and he needed iron man to win yeah iron man with mistake but he didn't he didn't grab it in time okay not too bad of a hand okay mr sinister for dr doom is not a bad deal that's fine too I think we have a lot of our key cards here, so we just need to wait and see. Ooh! Holy moly! I think we can do a invisible woman. We can do a magic. Okay, so we can do this to set ourselves up. And then we can do a magic. <laughs> what a waste. Okay. So we have a lot of the things that we need here really. The question is how we're gonna... <laughs> we can't possibly use Shocker to defend ourselves, right? Okay, that's fine. That's a okay. Hmm. Guess we can do this here. I'm quite tempted to see where this goes, so I'm just gonna go along with it. I mean, we have to beat ten power, so that's one thing. Oh, he decided to commit there. Nice, we won. We won. I think we won. Two no abilities is enough to net us the 30 power. Higher, further, faster, baby. Oh, oh, oh. Thank god, we, we made the right choice because if he had put America Chavez there, right, we could have, we could have lost. Yeah. <laughs> America Chavez in the middle, we straight up lose. <laughs> nice. Okay, we have quite a good. It's, it's... Okay, that was a good one. <laughs> Trading screw will go for Ultron. Not bad, not bad. I think we are playing against the same deck. This will be interesting. Uh, go with Shocker first. Ping, ping, ping. Then we will go for Mr. Sinister. Probably try my. Oh my god, this is a new pushy player, is it? I want to get the the conquest, Mr. Sinister. Hopefully, I can get it. In turn four, we can. <laughs> so cute. Okay, he's not playing high evolutionary. We are just playing the same deck. But let's just see who has a better one. I think we can just commit here. Just to guarantee that that two cuts because I want to be able to draw everything at the end of the day. Yeah. Nice. That one was a good one. Okay, so the play here would be to um do this. Hmm. 
And then... We can play out our... Our onslaught here. Yeah. Unfortunately... Probably... I think because we lost our... The fact that we lost our... Whatever it is, right? Like our squirrel go, it makes it very hard for us now. Yeah. Not quite sure whether this can get enough buff. Yeah, because usually you want to have like more, right? I think this deck, right, because we replace uh one of our no ability cards with crystal just to guarantee the combo, kind of weakens it a little, I would say. You need the perfect draw. I think you can snap here. I've I've some confidence, I was I to say. Yep. And since he committed to this Asgard, right, I think we can win because we just need two cards to push for enough power. Yep. Nice. I feel like we are just trashing like new players, isn't it? But look at this guy. He has committed so much to his patron. It looks pretty sick, I think, the black and white one. Yeah. But I can't wait for the other one. The variants are pretty cool too. Yeah, the upcoming ones. Okay, we have crystal. Nice. Uh, let's wait. I think we need to try and win this location. Because we can potentially... Oh my god, this is my first time seeing Uatu since so long ago, man. That was so long ago. Hmm. How do we do this though? Uh do we just go for Patriot and Mystic? I think we wait first. I'm not sure whether that was the right choice or not. I don't think I have enough hands for everything actually. So we might want to drop this here. Just to give ourselves some room. And I think we can do this. D no, no, no. Wrong side, wrong side. This side and this side. I think we snap here. We don't really need on stun anymore, actually. Yeah, that's fine. Then we can do this, and then we can just do this, right? Yep, I think this should be fine. Yeah, I think this is alright. Just copy. I'm not quite sure whether the second mystic will copy the same thing. Does it? Nice. Hopefully that's sufficient. Oh my god, we won by just one point. Ah, uh, this is nice. Wait, wait, wait. So did my second mystic copy it? Yes, it did. Good job, good job. Okay. I mean, we have magic, that's great. Uh, move all cards here. Mm. I think this is fine. Please don't hit my magic. Okay, that's that that's that's all right. That's all right. Not not important. This just in. Daredevil. Ooh, yo. Um. Okay, I think this is fine. We'll probably do a crystal on the right hand side. Yep, we just need to equalize that thing. Okay, that's cool. Um, we will do this here. Wind aid my ah crap, we can't do our combo now. We're in a pretty awkward position. Uh, guess we can just go ahead and do this instead. Hmm. 
<laughs> uh, let's start with a uh, magic. No, we don't really need that, right? I think all we need is we just need. We just need this. Then we need this. I think that's about right. Yeah, this is fine. This should be good enough. I think we snap. Not quite sure how he's gonna win this actually. Then we can just end it with Onslaught next turn. Yep, I think we are good. Doesn't really matter, I think we win here. What a disgusting hobgoblin. Ooh, we have a pretty good hand. Turn 1, turn 2, and turn 3. I think we can sacrifice Squirrel Go here. We just need the no ability once. Okay, not bad. Drop Shocker. Mm, if this location is not too bad, we'll just drop Brute. And then we are kind of done. So we just need to pray and hope we get our... Mm, our magic, yep. I mean, if we don't get it, then I think it's fine as well. It should be fine. Ooh, Hella. Is it Hella or is it just standard discard? I've, I've seen way too much Hella, but I haven't seen enough discard yet, which is unfortunate. Okay, we have a lot of our key pieces here. We have two more turns to grab whatever we need. Magic, please. Mm. Okay, we can probably do this. I think that's fine. We can still set it up pretty easily. Oh, wait, is he even a real player? Strange. Okay. Let's just do a mystic. And then... Um, we can't afford to put Mr. Sinister though, that's hard. It will block us out. So we don't really need that. We just do... Hmm. This is a tough part. We might have to just go with Mr. Sinister and go for Mystic. Because I was thinking whether we can do a Mystic to copy on slot, but I haven't set... I didn't set up my patron in time actually. Yeah. Hmm. I think the right play here is to go with this and this. Yep, there's no other way around it. Hmm. Do we need to snap here? I don't think so. Uh. Yes, we can snap. I mean, we have quite a fair bit of no ability cards. It's a bit late. But I suppose the person will kind of go, go along, I guess. It's fine. It's not a big deal. I don't think he will have went all the way to the end also. With us, yeah. Okay. Um. Not bad. If I could have hit my Mr. Sinister, that would be much better. But I'm not going to complain. Please don't hit. Escape. 